Hey folks, this is Joe with Raconteur Animation, and today I wanted to talk about how I do batch renames or rename multiple objects in Cinema 4D. So just to set up a plausible scenario here, say we've got um, a few cubes like this, and then as well we've got some spheres, so we'll just do a bunch of spheres and uh, let's say um, we've got some pyramids as well. So these are all different kinds of objects, but we need them all to be in a similar naming convention. So if we open up the naming tool that's under tools, naming tool, I'm going to pop this out here. Um, these options will enable us to automatically generate um, a name and a prefix and a suffix um, for all of these objects. And it's worth noting this portion here, I've tried to figure out how that works and why it works the way it is. Can't figure it out. So if you know um, what the heck this does, please let me know. It seems like you have to rename objects only one at a time and it always has to be done with some sort of a clunky preset um, method that you can't just type in a name um, so anyway if you know how that works let me know but um, for today we're just going to do it the way that I do it so we're going to select all of our objects and then here we can actually already rename um, our objects so I'm just gonna call it uh, fancy object and now you'll see that they're all the same name and if we want to add a number onto the end um, we have a few different options, either a number or a letter. If we look at the, here, I'll show you how to pull this open. Go to mode or this uh, hamburger menu here, show help. And that's going to pull up our naming tool, help here, options down here. You can see we can use these three um, shortcuts or syntax for adding a number, a letter, lowercase letter or upper case letter. Um, so we're going to do that for the suffix. We'll add an underscore dollar sign and the capital N. The prefix, um, we'll just call this, uh, I don't know, it is June 9th right now, so we'll just add June 9th. And I have all my objects selected here. I'm going to select the top one and then shift select the bottom so the numbers will run in that order and then just click replace name. So we've got a June 9th prefix fancy object underscore zero and then it counts zero to 11. Um, now say that we've got all these objects in our hierarchy and um, we want to change the name. So we can go back here. I'm gonna clear out these and replace fancy object with um, regular thing. And now I can just replace that string of text with my new string of text here and retain all the numbering and all of that. And also it is worth noting that this applies not just to objects but to any sort of object that you have in your scene. So um, these, for example, we have these tags applied to these objects. Right now they're all called Fong. So I'm going to, again, like we did before, um, rename them all at once using just this name field, call them my tag. And then I can go into this um, renaming tool and instead of objects, I'm going to select tags and then add this number suffix to them. And you can see here, now they're all separated out. And we can even do the same thing with um, materials. 
So say we have a bunch of different materials and now I want to first rename them. We're going to call this Joe's Shaders. Now they're all named Joe's Shaders and I'm going to add prefix of today suffix of underscore number. We're going to change the type to materials and rename. And you can you see you can do this with layers, takes, tags, objects, and everything. So that's how I batch rename in Cinema 4D. Hope it was helpful.